but this is a cooler, slow moving type of a fire. So it takes some time. We've got both of the smoke alarms here in ionization, which is commonly found here. The photoelectric, which usually picks up smoldering fires quicker. And when it goes off, we'll pull it up and the indicator will show which one is actually going off. So now you're starting to see smoke come off. It is very faintly coming off. So this is a cigarette butt that's in between two cushions inside of a couch. It could flame up. It could get the rest of the living room involved. It could smolder like this. And I've gone in homes where the entire couch was just a pile of ashes and nothing else in the, in the home burned. You can't take, if you take one breath of that, you can't take another breath. It's extremely poisonous. So the alarm went off. And it's the photoelectric alarm that went off. The photoelectric picked up little bits of smoke went through the electric ion and was picked up. But it is not releasing the ions that are needed to set off the ionization smoke alarm. So it's still smoking. We, um, I think in one test that we did, it took nine minutes for the other smoke alarm to go off. I guess as we did four tests last night and it, it took a considerable amount of time before the other one went off.